All right, Dan, you're welcome to start whenever you're comfortable. Awesome. Well, thank you everyone for being here today. Uh, my name is Dr. Dan Young, uh, and I'm here representing my company, Leadership Excellence Academy for Nonprofits, and introducing you to a new app that we, we are creating right now called Give a Latte. So what is Give a Latte? Basically, what we are is an app that's really trying to focus the world of intentional donors who consciously and consistently choose contribution over consumption. Uh, and yes, all those words start with C for a reason, and I'll talk a little bit about that in one second. So we know a number of different things about nonprofits. The first thing that we know is that there are 1.8 million nonprofits that are registered in the United States. Uh, as a point of emphasis and a point of comparison, in 1940, there were about 12,000. So it's compelling because nonprofits, if you think about it, are put in place to put themselves out of business. If the American Cancer Society had no more cancer, then there's no American Cancer Society. So when you have a proliferation of nonprofits that much, you know that there is there are ongoing problems. Now, there has been a decrease in the total number of donors by 7.1% from 2021 to 2022. And with that, even though the... Uh, Nonprofits contribute $2 trillion to the economy every year. And nonprofits um, create about $1.97 billion of revenue. Now, we know that one of the major challenges of nonprofits is continuing to have a strong base of donors. And that base of donors that they're working on right now are those folks who are digital natives, the folks who've grown up with the internet as part of their everyday academic pursuits. And these folks have had over 20,000 hours of television watching, 10,000 hours of video watching, and less than 5,000 hours of actually reading books. So what's the idea? We want to make an app that makes it as simple to give as deciding to forego a cup of coffee to give to your favorite nonprofit. And the solution is an app called Give a Latte, which will have someone record some level of a consumptive behavior that they would make on an ongoing basis and instead divert that payment to a nonprofit. So if I go to the Brouhaha coffee shop and I spend $3.55 every day for my brewski, um, I can make a choice via push notification to share that the cost of that cup of coffee to my favorite nonprofit in a seamless way. And this really focuses on the nonprofit's um, basic mantra, which is they're always looking for time, talent, and treasure. Now, if we're going to tap into the digital native market, which can be known as millennials, um, Generation Z, and Generation Alpha, we have to include in that telephone because that is a crucial part of their everyday living. So right now, we uh, online fundraising creates about $40 billion, $700 million dollars online. We're going after 0.001% of that total revenue, which would equal $40,700,000. So as funding competition grows, nonprofits have to find new revenue streams by enhanced segmentation. So we've designed an app solution called Give a Latte that targets next-gen digital natives, creates emotional connections, and redirects impulsive behavior for social good. So users can self-select when they're most likely to consume impulsively, and it eliminates the donor marketing guessing game. So we want to focus on choosing a behavior over a dollar figure. We were gamifying this particular action. We engage the users with attractive designs and visuals. The people get social clout. So every time that they give up some sort of a behavior in order to give to a nonprofit, they get an automatic push to their favorite social media that says that they gave. And it creates a social environment where people can see other people's interactions, which adds to that social clout. So in terms of the leadership of the group, we have a number of folks who have a long career in both nonprofit and educational work. I myself did an entire dissertation that was focused on impulse online giving to nonprofits um, when I got my PhD at Temple University. My business partner is a grant writer and has done a TEDx talk on, on the ROI of grant writing. And our designer, uh, Marla Harmon, is an experienced app designer that is, that's well-versed in a number of different types of marketing. Now, there are a number of different competitive, uh, the number of different comparable platforms, but our competitive advantage is, first of all, the experience of the team. There's not going to be another team out there that has the experience we have. 
We focus on the behavior over the dollars. So people don't have to worry so much about the actual dollars, but the behavior. The person can sit, can self-identify the sacrifice that they're going to make through push notifications. You get the additional social clout um, from making those different choices. And there's leverage at all levels on the donor, the nonprofit, the business, and the influencer level. We would use the funds that would come from Swim with Sharks for marketing, legal, and administrative help, as we've already gotten some funding through our EDGE grant to be able to, to do the app. And that's it. There's our information, info at, at academyfornonprofits.com, and I'm ready, really ready, willing, and able to answer any questions. Thank you.